St. Charles Luanga Catholic Secondary School at Guerrero State to NCD is only 15 years old, but it has excelled academically since its inception. The school has slowly been building its infrastructure over the years, and the current structure is the most costly one. Mr. Kara said the department was impressed that this school had found their way into the PIP wing of the Department for National Planning and Monitoring to access 500,000 kina to complement the 1 million kina which was committed by the parents and guardians of the students to build this facility. Education for a child, this must be a commitment and a concerted effort by all, which includes parents, the school and the uh, wider community. The chairman of the Board of Governors, Patrick Kianga, said though there were funds available through the education department, they did not access any of them. Instead, parents contributed much to accomplish what is in place today. If you can recall some news of some funds called RACI funds for the schools, billions came. And the people that were put in charge to ensure that this money was expended made a mess of it. The failure to access the RACI funds left two unfinished buildings on the school grounds, which were meant for teachers' houses. According to the principal, the school still has need for teacher accommodation as well as new classrooms for grade 7 and 8. Our next priority project is setting up and furnishing of our computer lab for the upper secondary school, which will cost more than 100,000 kina. Brother Matthew said the parents have been the backbone behind the school over the years and now they are expecting the governor, the Department for National Planning and Monitoring, and member for Mosby Northwest to fund further development projects for this school. Frida Kana, TV1 News.